This is a rap recording for the new Adam Sandler film, The Cobbler. You can watch it on Netflix.com. It's free. Um, this is um, dedicated to Adam Sandler, one of your biggest fans. I watched The Cobbler on a Sunday night, and then I thought to myself, hey, alright, this is gonna be a great movie, he makes good comedy, and then, man, turned out it was a dramedy, that's drama plus comedy, the man makes shoes, and then you go and you're like, hey, what's he gonna do, cause the shoes are magic, they turn him into men, and you're like, hey, what if a shoe turned him into a hen on a farm and he started clucking and shit, but hey, that's a different movie together, I copyrighted it, hey, in the movie, he turns into Method Man. You're like, oh man, but the dude is real mean. I'm like, hey, that's depressing, man. Call me Depression Man, because this movie made me sad. Alright, okay, verse two is the, the cobbler. The cobbler was a really weird movie. He dates his mom dressed as his dad. He's wearing his dad's shoes. And you're like, ew, gross, fucking ew. He's dating his mom and he's kissing her as his dad and shit. Man, this is supposed to be sympathetic, but I'm on the edge of my seat about to vomit all over my computer screen because this shit is weird. I don't really know what to do here. Why is Adam Sandler making these movies? He kills Method Man with a high heeled toe shoe. And you're like, okay man, what, what's it gonna do? He saves an apartment building and he seduces a Hispanic woman. I don't know man, it's a movie. What? I, I got nothing to prove, see? All I did was watch it. And I got some questions. In the last 10 minutes, he find out his dad was alive and watching him dressed as Steve Buscemi, eating pickles. He probably drove a Chevy. He probably fucking watched Ed, Ed, and Eddie because the movie was so boring he didn't want to watch it himself. And I'm like, hey man, I'm thinking of killing myself because this movie goes on for two fucking hours. <laughs> oh, shit. Why are we having people pay Adam Sandler? Who the fuck is buying all these tickets? Frankly, I'd be out in the south in 100 degrees cutting through thickets rather than watching this shit. Who paid for Jack and Jill? Who paid for Grown Ups too? Man, we're all grown ups, we should know this too. Like, who the fuck is the executive shelling this out? Who is buying these movies? Who is selling them out? I don't know, man, I just got some fucking questions. We need to save the youth, we need to keep them. Who's teaching the youth? Who's in the schools? Who's fucking putting Grown Ups 2 on the television, poisoning the kids? I don't know, man. I just know what it is. I know that Grown Ups 2 was shit. I know that Jack and Jill was retarded. I know that all this shit was dumb. Am I going crazy? Shit. <laughs>